My name is Maria Zurek. I did my PhD at the Institute for Nuclear Physics. And in my PhD dissertation, I was concentrating on probing symmetries in the microscopic world of elementary particles using the VASA detector located at Cooler Synchrotron COSI here at Forschungszentrum Jülich. 14 billion years ago, our universe was created in the Big Bang. But nowadays, we still do not completely understand why our world exists as it is. One approach to address this primary question of modern science is to look at symmetries in the world of small elements of matter, the world of elementary particles. In my PhD project, I was concentrating on the asymmetry between two lightest quarks the smallest elements, which together with electrons, are creating all visible matter. But why this symmetry is actually important? The fact that the two lightest quarks are not perfectly symmetric, the fact that their masses are slightly different, results in protons being stable, and therefore hydrogen atom being stable, which are building me, you, and our whole world. In practice, in our experiment, we are smashing accelerated particles called deutrons, and we are looking at the particular type of reaction, which can be observed only if the two smallest quarks are not perfectly symmetric. The atmosphere of Forschungszentrum Jülich is created by the people working here. So, for example, in my institute during the experiment, it's a hive of activity. Uh, during lunches with my friends, the atmosphere is usually silly and lighthearted. In general, I would say it's professional, cooperative and friendly. I remember very well when after my 10 week long doctoral experiment, I've seen in the control room of um, our accelerator on the screen that the beam of deutrons was ramped down. I remember very well all the emotions which are accompanying me then. I was relieved that finally this 10 week long, very, very stressful time is finally over. I was happy that the experiment went smoothly. I was excited about the future results, but I also felt the weight of the responsibility about uh, the future results, about uh, the next two and a half years, which I have to analyze this data. In the field of particle physics, we all work together in big groups. The success of one collaborator is the success of the whole collaboration. I'm extremely honored winning the Excellence Prize and it actually confirmed my belief that I've been working here with exceptional specialists in my research area and I'm really immensely grateful for their support they gave me here for the last three years. Just after my PhD, I joined the effort of our institute in another very challenging project of searching another symmetry breaking patterns in so-called electric dipole moments of particles. This project addresses one of the greatest mystery of our very existence the fact that we can see such a strong dominance of matter over antimatter in our universe, even if just after Big Bang they were produced exactly in the same amount. Uh, after this uh, one year of the postdoctoral experience here, I got very good, I would say solid research and development training. And right now I'm in a very, very exciting moment of my scientific career. In two weeks, I'm moving to the USA. I got a postdoctoral position at the Lawrence Berkeley National Lab, and I will be continuing my adventure in understanding matter, especially understanding the internal structure of proton with the STAR experiment located at Brookhaven Lab, US.